I'd like to talk about something that I'd like to talk about something that's uh, been on my mind the past hour and I usually talk to myself but I just thought that I should um, just get this on camera and it's about how lonely people are and how lonely people especially and my generation, Gen, Gen Z, Gen, even millennials, and um, we're just so lonely. And it's as if no one has anyone to reach out to anymore when the population is just as horrendously large as it is. I feel like there are so many people who just go through life and go through so many things with no community and no one to share moments with, uh, I'd like to advocate for myself and give some examples. One year, I spent Thanksgiving all by myself. I didn't have any friends. I didn't have anyone to talk to. I didn't have anyone to have, have Thanksgiving dinner with. Um, one time I had to have surgery, and this is actually very, very personal to me. One time I had to have surgery because for a while, I, I mean, I want kids someday, and so I tried doing the, well, traditional way of sperm extraction um, to, freeze, to freeze sperm, and I was unable to do so, so I had to surgically get reproductive tissue um, taken out of my organs to be to to be frozen for later use um, if I ever find a partner in life and I'd like to talk about today where I feel like if there was a new movie out in town and I wanted to go to a movie with someone. I don't have anyone in my life that lives here in Tucson. I don't have anyone in the state of Arizona that I can call or text and say, hey, do you wanna go to a movie with me? And have someone say yes, or have anyone reach, uh, anyone respond at all. I don't have anyone like that in my life. Another thing I thought about was, what if I had another mental spiral breakdown and I almost lose my goddamn mind and I need to go to the hospital? Do I have anyone I can call <laughs> to take me or take care of me? And I don't have anyone. Eventually my grandmother would be called, but she's a snowbird in Phoenix. I don't have any peers, any colleagues my age. And there's so many people I would love to be friends with. So many people I would love to reach out and I'd love to be friends with them, but I feel like I am either not enough for them or I am too much for people. <laughs> And I so badly, I, I want friends. I want friends! I want friends! <laughs> and I don't feel like I have any. I have friends, but they're in different hemispheres. And they're in different area codes and they're in different states.
And I think that, and I tell myself, oh, it'll all be better once I finally get to Hawaii and, and I'll have all, I'll have friends there and I'll have all these amazing things and I don't know if I'm even going to Hawaii. I'm prob I don't know if I'm going to Hawaii. I'll probably stay in Arizona. Probably stay in Tucson for another summer.